In this video, I'm going to uh, show, demonstrate how to set the Java Home and Flyer Mental Variable under Windows. So, first thing we need to do is uh, locate where Java is installed. So I'm going to start that up. I'm going to go into the this uh, Windows Explorer and search for that. You know, if it's, let's see, this is a, uh, what do you call 64-bit Windows. Let's see if I have it in here. We'll look under, uh, under Java. And there's the JDK. So this is, you know, Java is all, I could put it in here. This is one, one way I could use this path because the, uh, you know, the Java, Java is, uh, is defined in here. And, uh, but I could also put, uh, use this as the Java home as well. And in fact, uh, that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to copy that. And then um, this, is the, this is the folder that contains the Java development kit. This is the folder that contains the uh, Java runtime environment. So these are two different versions. They both contain two different versions of, of, uh, of the Java virtual machine runtime environment. So let's see, I want to start up um, control panel, click on uh, system and security, look at uh, system here, and then click on advanced system settings. And there's a button down here, environmental variables. And I'm going to, uh, down here, system variables, I'm going to create a new variable. It's called Java underscore home. Those are all in uppercase letters. That's an underscore. For the variable value, I'm going to paste in that path. So it's not the it's not the bin folder. It's the folder that contains the bin folder as well as the other uh, folders and files that are installed with uh, the Java development kit. Okay, so I'm going to set it like that. You could also use the, the JRE folder as well. That would also work in this situation, I think. Well, it depends on the application that depends on this. So there it is. Hit OK, and that's, that's it. 